wasn't the case for the oldest feudal defensive structures, the palace of the Marquis Melpignano is the result of an architectural reconfiguration carried out in the 17th century, which led to the transformation of the fortress into a noble palace. As stated on the inscription placed on the strip at the top of the façade, the construction of the public building was promoted by the feudal lord Giorgio Castriota. The upper floors were designated for the personal use of the feudal lords, while the lower floors were the seat of the baronial court for the administration and execution of juridical matters. The only remains of the ancient manor are the moat and the imposing southern defensive walls, marked by the towers and a guard walkway. Inside the palace you can enjoy the lovely Italian-style garden, enhanced by the presence of a pergola and a magnificent architectural elements, which offer visitors a charming view. The palace was purchased by the municipality of Melpignano in the mid-1990s. At the moment it is undergoing restoration work in order to make the palace and the garden usable.